Want to play your favorite PlayStation 4 games on your PC? Today, I'll show you how to set up the FPPS4 emulator on your PC. So, get ready to experience PS4 gaming on a whole new level. Before proceeding, you should check the compatibility list of the PS4 games that can run on this emulator. FPPS4 is still an early development, so not all games will work perfectly and performances may vary. Currently, it can run 110 games which is only 6% of all PS4 games available. The list mainly consists of 2D and indie titles. 3D games are more challenging to emulate, but progress is being made. To check if your favorite game is playable or not, search the game title here. Now, let's go ahead and set up the FPPS4 on a Windows PC. First, head over to the FPPS4 GitHub page and download the latest release. We'll also need Timmy's launcher for the easier game management. NWJS framework is also required for the launcher to function properly. You can find it under the how to install section on Timmy's launcher's github page. Also, download a pkg editor like lib or breeze pkg to extract your pkg game files. Next, create a new folder for FPPS4 and place all your downloads there. Extract the launcher and NWGS files into this main folder. Now, run this windows batch file to open Timmy's launcher. Then just close it, and the launcher will create necessary folders in the main FPPS4 directory. After that, extract the FPPS4 emulator, and place the FPPS4 folder into the newly created EMU folder. Guys, I have downloaded a game called Undertale which is in PKG format. I need to extract this game into the game's subfolder in the main FPPS4 folder. Inside this game's folder, create a new folder and name it after the game for easy identification. Now we are going to use the PKG editor. So first, extract it. Double click on this exe file to launch the pkg editor. Locate your pkg game file on your PC. Select your game and it should show up in the pkg editor. Click on export to gp4 project. Navigate the folder you created for your game. Click save. You should see a message saying PKG exported. If your game has an update file, repeat the same steps and save it in the same folder with the game file. Now go back to the FPPS4 folder and open the launcher again. 
if you did everything correctly, it should now recognize your extracted game. As you can see, the Undertale game is listed in the launcher. The emulator doesn't have many settings to play around with, so you can leave everything in the default settings. The emulator only supports Xbox controllers, not PS4 controllers. Your buttons will be mapped out by default. To launch your game, simply click on Run Game. If everything set up correctly, your PS4 game should be running on your PC. Guys, I do not have an Xbox controller, so I can't show you by playing this game. But you have got the idea and you should now be able to play your PS4 games using the FPPS4 emulator. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like and subscribe for more such content. Let me know in the comments which PS4 games you are most excited to play on your PC. Until next time, happy gaming.